I like that that an album with themes about like time and space like <laughs> make it the best version of itself. That's like hugely thematic and full circle. So. Yeah. I I've just always been like a very deeply emotional um, person, and I get I I just like really make meaning out of everything. So to me, it just feels like such an alignment with like who I am as a person. Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it's yeah, it's like a very personal album too. So it feels like uh, I don't know. I'm like coming into my own or like reaching womanhood or something. These are just this song at this moment that we captured it, and it's yeah. kind of like that was that was that moment that we captured that song, and it doesn't matter. You could do, yeah. we could do it again. Like we could redo the album in, in ten years, and it would be like a different thing. But yeah. like this is a record of the time, you know, and the space. <laughs> and like Michael's always saying, like when we when I'm like, no, I need to redo like that one syllable in that one nanosecond of my vocal because I don't like how it sounds. Michael's like. No, and and it's so it's so interesting because like I come from a disciplined classical music background and like you know wanting to get the perfect take and Michael doesn't come from that background but Michael has this insane sixth sense to to hear and to feel and to hear how something feels and to feel how something he- sounds and like so he's like no did that take make the hairs on my arm stand up that's the take that we're, that's the correct take and I'm like. Okay, if you say so, and it, it like makes my job so much easier because I have someone to like, you know, when we have like 57 takes of something and I'm like, God, I don't know which one we should use or like how many of these we should piece together. He's like, this is what we're going to do. And this is the, like, this is the way it needs to be. And I trust him. I'm a roadblock, time stops, the noise drops, I'm at a loss with no thought. With no thoughts Cause I'm a roadblock Who thought you watch While the doors are locked And I can't cross I can't cross Make each step Take each breath Hold my chest Just in case I forget with Mike, Arjun, and Logan. They're like, they, they are the project. I used to write everything at the piano and then 
um, you know, I figure out the arrangements. And what I do now is I still, everything starts at the piano usually. But now, like, what starts to happen is they, they write all their parts in, if I don't have, like, a specific idea. And um, I'll take a new song to rehearsal and we'll just arrange it. I always used to feel like it was a crutch that I only wrote at the piano, but now it's just this magic process that happens that's truly a collaboration. Thanks so much for being here and celebrating the release of Space. We're so happy to have you. This next song is from the album and it's called Spinning Record. Everything great Time stands so still throughout another day Autopilot barely awake TV static, a lover who drifts away And I don't know how you did it I always try but then I quit it I don't want to admit it A daily struggle just to exist And the record keeps on spinning Another day, another minute Drop the needle in the middle The spinning record keeps me in it I try and I try and I try and I try
people you were writing like stuff with like just piano yeah. and so it would be like through composed yeah. if you will there would yeah. just be like no space and song. no right it's just like here's Let's, a whole thing how can we fit how can we fit everything right around the, around the what already exists yeah it's more like hey here's, here's like here's a kind of a structure and a thing yeah. and like what's going to take place of this and what's going to like take this place in the arrangement what's going to do this and what's you know, yeah so it's, it's kind of it's cool it's probably that moment of trust too where yeah. it's like you know um even if you present something to them you're going to trust that they are not that they have the song's best interest in mind, but it's right. more of like, okay, how can we build upon this? You know, right, right, right. Like, exactly. No, it's kind of working to the top right. goal. Mm-hmm. And, and they all, because like, I've known, you know, I've known them for years now, and we've been playing together for, for like a few years now, they, they, we're all on the same page. They're, they always, you know, they're so good, and they're so smart, and they have such a deep understanding of music, and also specifically of like, the vibe of this project so they do definitely have the song's best interest but also they they challenge it as well so that it's not always the same thing and, um and if i don't always have like the vocabulary to explain what i want they they really like give it the the time and energy to figure that out um and we have a lot of fun figuring it out and so it's just it's like this really special process um but I do, like, I try to come in with as much of a song, and then we go from there. This next song is a new one. It's not on the album, and it was the first song that I wrote during quarantine. It's called Quiet. Dancing in silence, so loud in the quiet, wherever we try to go. Forsake me at sunrise I'm looking in your eyes They tell me all I need to know When your heart beats louder than the words You never even told me Silence is so loud Always wonder why you kept so quiet I wish I could help why are you so proud? Dancing in silence, so loud in the quiet, wherever we try to go. Forsake me at sunrise, I'm looking in your eyes, they tell me all I need to know. Oh, I think that you might need a little volume. Wish that I could push a button, turn us right back on The radio's broken, no sound since we've spoken I wish I could tell you, but I'd be too loud And you know where to be Always found it hard, you the voice from my head Thoughts like daggers cutting me instead dancing in silence so loud and quiet wherever we try to go forsake me at sunrise i'm looking in your eyes they tell me all i need to know dancing in silence so loud and quiet wherever we Try to go. I'm not asking for you to have an answer for every little question, but don't leave me on red. Then, how did the writing process change um, from the beginning of the album to like this last year in quarantine? And um, what is the completed version? How does that compare to the earliest version of it? So, okay, this is this is what I remember. So, back in 2016, I wrote a song, I started writing a song very quickly. It just came to me in like a few minutes. And those songs are always the biggest gifts. I wrote a song 
called Permission and Michael's like, this is the best song you've ever written, you know? <laughs> and I'm like, I don't know, like whatever. And then I kind of put it aside and I had my All That Matters EP. And I was doing all that stuff solo and I was working with the guys in Darla, which is how I met Mike, who plays in my band, who plays bass. And then I put that EP out in 2018 and I think that I didn't have any songs for the album except for Permission. And then immediately after All That Matters came out, Logan and I started um, talking and kind of hanging out and I really, it was all the, always this thing where um, the guys in Darla were like, you should really talk to Logan and Arjun who are in Trap Rabbit because I think that you guys would really get along. And so that's pretty much exactly what we did. Um, I had this idea, or I think Michael had this idea that I should maybe step away from always playing piano on my own songs. And so Logan started working through the piano part for Permission. This next song is the first song that we released from space and it's called Permission.
to be happy. Say it's cool if I don't care. Every moment I won't go there. And you feel like the themes are universal in the album? Like, you know, it's kind of, as you were talking about, just like the space and kind of the feeling and the emotion that went behind it. So do you feel like, like people could kind of like, you know, even though it's very specific to you, the overall theme is kind of universal? Definitely. I mean, the album, like, the album is about, it has themes of feeling really attached to somebody and them not reciprocating and also feeling um, like being aware of the relationship that we have with ourselves and um, setting boundaries and coming into your own and I think that all of that is really universal like finding your place in the world saying was like it's really important to catch the song to oh, so to write the song to record it and release it and kind of catch that moment when you're not sick of it and when it still feels relevant and I think that for a lot of the album that's still the case <laughs> <laughs> what inspired the new song it sounds super different I thought it sounded like jazzy like Tiger's Jaw ish very indie cool um, <laughs> yeah what, where did that come from well, the song was born um, from, you know, it was, it's a song that means a lot to me. It's a really personal song. It's about loss. 
It's about a time in my life that meant a lot. It's about the past, but when I wrote it, what was so cool about it was I was trying to figure out the, the like piano arrangement and Logan had this idea for this like churning piano part and then when we all came together, I was like, I don't know how we're gonna do this. I don't want to do like another ballad. Like, how are we gonna make this cool? And then I think like Arjun came up with this like so like very exciting drum groove, and Mike started doing this bass stuff that like you had never really done before. Don't play with a pick typically, <laughs> and yeah, the full time was sweet. Yeah, yeah, it was really just an entirely different place for us. Right. And so what happened was it made it just it brought new life and to the song that was like such a sad and like very personal song. It's just like so fun. It's like the, one of my favorite songs that we're working on. And I didn't know that it would sound like that at all. No pun intended. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sophie and I have talked about like yeah. getting together to write songs. Yeah. When she writes with Logan, there's something that they accomplish. And then she's like, if I wrote with you, would I get any rhythmic elements that yeah. might be like new to my music? And I'm, I thought that might be true, but we we haven't we haven't sat down yet. We should. Yeah, we, we will. We will. <laughs> but that was a good example of like Sophie wrote a song that was definitely like a ballad. It could have been. It was like I didn't know. Blah, blah. But it's like yeah. if you just double time it, then suddenly it's like, well, it's not about the song you wrote. It's about what we all collectively just had to do with it. Yeah. And I think that's a really special moment that I had and we all had. It was like, yep, cool. Absolutely. Screw it up. Make a radio head. <laughs> yeah. Snow Patrol. Snow Patrol. Yeah. <laughs> Snow Patrol. Wait, yeah. Where did that yeah. Go? yeah. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Chocolate. Right. This is all home. Spiritually and mm. physically and mentally and all of, the, all of those things. Uh, working on stuff with y'all. You guys. Guys, there's always there's always so many things going on. So it, even that space came out, it just feels like space two already started. So yeah. I, you know the work never stops. It, it, I'm it, happy. <laughs> let's let's go and make another one. <laughs> it does it does feel like yeah. it's great. It's like so amazing. It's done and it feels like it. It wasn't like disappointing. Like so many projects can kind of creative projects or like you know you make something and it turns out that it doesn't look like the picture that you were trying to copy, you know or trying to do or whatever it just didn't turn out how you expected it and this feels like it did yeah. and that's super exciting but then it feels like there's a whole like you say there's a whole other thing waiting to go here's a brand new song for a little taste of what we're working on post space this is i didn't know Falling down to the ground 
thoughts. I feel like we covered everything. Have I said how much I love the people that I work with and how grateful I am to work with them? Yeah. <laughs> Has that been expressed clearly? <laughs> <laughs>